So about a year ago, I showed you vapesters how to build the Clapton coil. And let me tell you what, man, it was a big hit. Everybody was building them and everybody was loving them. And guess what? Now we got vendors out there selling this Clapton wire by the meter. The guys that sent this stuff to me to review for you guys is selling five meters for like eight or nine bucks. Here's the plan. We're going to go ahead and dive down. I'm going to show you this Clapton coil wire. I'm going to do a dual macro coil build. And then we're going to come back. I'm going to vape on her some more. And then I'm going to wrap it up and let you know where you can get some. Sound like a plan? Let's go. Skeezo! <laughs> so here's the box this wire comes in. It's actually made by a company called UD Yao Technology out of China. They're the guys that made the IGOs, the IGO Ls, the IGO Ws, all drippers, which they made back in the mid to early 2013s, and now they're making their way back into the vape game. Again, here's the front of the box, and then on the back of the box, they mention what wire comes with this wire. 26 gauge canthal and 32 gauge canthal. And then inside, you got your little packet with your spool of wire. And here's the little spool of this wire you receive. Okay, you get five meters of this stuff, and that's about 16, a little over 16 feet of wire. So here's another close-up view of this wire for you. It's a type of Clapton wire is all it is. What they're doing is they're taking 32-gauge canthal, and they're wrapping around 26-gauge canthal. And what it looks like they're doing is they're wrapping two strands of 32-gauge canthal around a single strand of 26-gauge canthal. They're first wrapping one strand of 32-gauge canthal, and then doubling back with another strand of 32-gauge canthal. So what I've done is I've cut two pieces of this Clapton type type wire five inches about five inches in length and what I'm going to do is two macro coils wrapped around a one eighth inch drill bit it's actually not a one eighth inch drill bit I'm going to be wrapping around but it's going to be a one eighth inch screwdriver and all I'm going to do for each macro coil is six wraps Blowing from the inside out. It's exactly what we want, baby. So that right there is an up close look at this Clapton type wire. Let's go ahead and take her back to FaceTime. Okie dokie, so I've got this dual Clapton wire build reading at 0.4 ohm, sitting in the Velocity RDA, vaping at 50 watts, sitting on this Yehi SX Mini. And I gotta tell you what, the vape experience I'm getting off this wire is gnarly. It's awesome. I gotta admit, at first I was skeptical. Skeptical because this wire comes out of China. No disrespect to China, but a lot of these Chinese manufacturers are stating that their wire is American made, and it's not. It's not. You could tell when it's Chinese Canthal because Chinese Canthal tastes like poo. It tastes like shit. This does not. This tastes like American made Canthal. So the online vape shop that sent this wire to me to review for you guys is a shop by the name of eSiggity, eSiggity.com. I'll have a link in the description. And right Right now, eSiggity is selling five meters of this stuff for $8.99. Now, the question is, would I go out and buy it? Probably not. And the reason is, is because I have the resources. I have all the wire. I know how to do builds. I mean, this is what I do, guys. I've been doing builds for like three and a half, four years now, okay? It's what I do on a daily basis. I think for the vapor out there that has arthritis or the vapor that just is lazy, that don't want to deal with that, wants just the convenience of it, you could pop it in there and go, you're going to get a great vape experience. Yeah, I think it's worth it. This is Rip Trippers, and remember, smoking is dead, vaping is the future, and the future is now.